it was pretty tough actually i think um it's very steep and if you don't know what you're like expecting people think sometimes it's just like a hike but no it's it's very brutal but once you get to the top it's worth it because it's got a good view and and you did it too because it's it's a good accomplishment i know that because there's just so many cool rocks that like you can't see anywhere besides like that's probably the only place you could see them unless like you go i don't know yeah they're just so rare like the formations like the kissing camels and then the um there's a rock that like balances on the balances, balancing rocks, the balancing yeah. rocks. Yeah. yeah it's just like amazing piece like you never know like that can actually happen it's just standing there and yeah. they're all like in one area Yeah, so my, uh, my dad lived lived there for eight years when he um, wrestled. He went to Sydney as an alternate, but he lived there for eight years and trained um, wrestling. And yeah, um, and also my um, my old, little brother, my older brother, I mean, he swam. He we've always done sports there, and there's there's practicing, and we usually go there a lot sometimes. But we go there a lot just to even look at it, and sometimes there's pro athletes like olympic athletes there. yeah i was gonna say do you ever see do you ever see any cool my athletes old, coming through my um older brother actually when he was practicing when he was swimming at the time he um he was swimming to practicing and he was the uh, lane right next to katie ledecky a lot of my friends and my mom's friends have said it's really cool and just you can spend multiple hours in there just looking at history and how good people are at their sport. I mean, well, obviously we have the Olympics going on right now. Do you think people in Colorado Springs, you know, care that much more about it because it's right here? Those facilities are like right here. Somewhere? Yeah, I think I think it's going to attract a lot more people because, I mean, it's just Colorado's becoming the state where, like, oh, wow, the Olympic Training Center's there and now there's the Olympic Museum. And people are going to be like, that's one of the reasons why people might want to go to Colorado Springs instead of Denver. Yeah. Which is pretty cool I think it's pretty interesting and cool last spot we kind of hitting on our tour um, the Broadmoor a really famous hotel um, they've got a golf course there too yeah what what do you uh, what do you know about the Broadmoor what does that kind of bring, to this, bring to this city I've had a lot of I've actually gone to Broadmoor a lot um, I've had just from like just I mean even like having breakfast there and even just walking around, they have like a lake, like a big lake in between their two hotels and walking around is just so beautiful.